it's really strong. You know, this could be our bus stops, it could be our vineyard fence posts, there's all kinds of uses in agriculture. <music> composite board is made out of rubbish and uh, it, it's a way of incorporating fibre into plastics that would otherwise go to waste and making useful products. We're spinning rubbish into gold. We've built a beautiful raised bed garden, concrete boxing, fantastic compost bin. The list of products we could build with this is endless. In fact we might not have enough rubbish. The stuff that's in it is, is truly horrific or wonderful, depending on your point of view. Uh, the old polystyrene meat tray, the dirty coffee cup you had at lunch, uh, you used toothpaste tube, a chippy wrapper, some biscuit wrap, a broken wheelie bin, some old pipe, bits of bamboo, even tantalised timber, which is really dangerous stuff because you can't burn it and you can't bury it. All of that goes into the mix to make a strong, durable, uh, board which you can use for all kinds of purposes and which can be finished with simple hand tools. This has been an amazing collaboration initially with the University of Auckland and then we got uh, John Sadler from JTEC Industries involved. The guy's a very senior plastics engineer uh, with a factory and all the toys and all the tools and that's how we've been able to produce this fantastic new product. Our initial uh, project was to build a, a compost bin. Uh, then we started uh, to play with raised bed gardens. And the latest iteration is a, a concrete edging, a concrete boxing replacement that you can leave in situ. We could be building perhaps John Key's cycleways from Kaitaia to Bluff using this stuff on the edge. The engineered composite board project is nearing the end of its third year of development. We're absolutely ready now to scale that right up. We could be turning that into jobs and sustainable products that we can use in our own community and which communities all over New Zealand could be doing. And we could be taking 60% out of the waste stream. That's 60% that's currently going off in compactor trucks, uh, going off the town and going into a hole in the ground. Landfills are a limited resource and they're pretty unsafe as well. We could be building our bus shelters, we could be building our wharves out of this. Imagine a vineyard with posts made out of rubbish. Music